Hey, this is Heather from the Renaissance English History Podcast, and this is your Tudor Minute for October the 17th. Today in 1586, Sir Philip Sidney died. Philip was born in 1554 in Kent. He's remembered for his poetry. He's a famous poet. He's also a national hero for defending the Protestants in the Low Countries and dying in battle. His death is remembered as being supremely poetic. He died of a gunshot wound and then gangrene, and he actually gave up his water to another wounded soldier telling the soldier, thy necessity is yet greater than mine. So it's very tragic. His father, Sir Henry Sidney, had actually been a close advisor to Edward VI. When the young king died, he somehow stayed in favor with Queen Mary. Mary wasn't known for keeping the Protestants in good favor, but he was. And he named his son Philip after Mary's husband, Philip of Spain. Philip of Spain also agreed to be the godfather. Philip's mother was Lady Mary Dudley. She was the sister to Robert Dudley, Earl of Leicester, who was, of course, famous for being Queen Elizabeth's um, soulmate, as it were. Philip would marry Francis Walter. Walsingham's daughter, Francis Walsingham, was the famous spymaster of Elizabeth, so he was right in the middle of this whole little network of Protestant nobility. He studied at Oxford, and then he became an envoy to the King of France, and he experienced and survived the St. Bartholomew's Day Massacre in France, where Protestant Huguenots were massacred by Catholics throughout France. He's buried at St. Paul's Cathedral in London. That's your Tudor Minute for today. Remember, you can dive deeper into life in 16th century England through the Renaissance English History Podcast at englandcast.com.